Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Contract Part 15. I'm your host, Mefu. Last episode, we defeated the Vlad with our dual dagger build, barely scraping by by an inch, pretty much. So let's heal up at the creepy statue to fall again, get our elixirs back, and check out the shop. What have we got here? I think I've seen this one before. If undamaging, if undamaged during this turn, your crit will be increased by 20%. Lasting one turn, that's pretty strong. Discounted as well, it's 284. That's actually a really strong common. I'm actually going to take that, I think. Uh, let me have a quick look what else is. By the time you enter a combat room, one random buff will be applied. Make sure options will be available for all lock type drops. Oh, I understand what that means now. Okay. I remember like uh, a few parts ago, I didn't understand what that meant. This glass tag is really strong though, because I'm not normally that damaged that often, and undamaged will work quite nicely with the Shadow of Assault. Um, yeah, so it's like a, almost a flat 20% crit I've got. So that's 25% crit, so I'm literally critting one full for the time. I'm going to take that, it's discounted as well, so that's a no-brainer. Sweet. I need a new weapon. So I'm hoping I get some good weapons this time. I don't want to be stuck with a common weapon the whole run. Let's go in and see what they're going to send at us this time. Hopefully no more Vlads as well. Not until I get a bit stronger anyway, because uh, that was so, so close. So close. Alright, break these, grab the gold. Grab the gold anymore. Nope. To the right then. Hello, defender. Oh, you're getting stabbed. So I didn't go in this here. Let's just let, I'll let him cast first. Come on. Come on. Come on. I bet as soon as I go invisible, he's gonna cast. I was going to get demon form. There we go. There we go. Gives you a lot of shield, that demon form. It works really nice with dual daggers. Is this coming out? That's coming out. Don't move up. Okay. I can probably just... Yeah, that's what I was waiting for. I was going to say, I could probably just uh, wait until he casts something to blink into him and just annihilate him. Oh, the rooms are empty. Okay, cool. <laughs> Thank God as well, because I would have got t taken some damage there. So I'm not sure if I want to change out my familiars yet. I'll see what weapon I get. If I get another weapon, I'll change them out. But for now, I actually really like this combo. Demonic Stance, the Arrival, plus the Stealth, plus another Gleep. It's just loads of mobility. So it's really strong. If I get melee weapons, that is. What's this? Use controller to alter surrounding environment. Okay, it's the uh, thing again. What does the future hold for the kingdom under the sea? Its fate is now in your hands. I wonder if I can like come back and boost it at the end. Nah, it wouldn't be any fun with it. Let's boost them now. Clean ocean will allow the sea creatures to thrive. It's indeed something to look forward to. So let's confirm enemies within the dream realm feel stronger than before. So I've made them stronger by twice, two times now. And then the third time be even stronger. I just wanted a better ending. So I'm hoping it actually affects the ending. It's not just me just being a... Uh, Mash assist for no reason. So let's go up. Familiar crystal. Mad farm says crystallized frost giant. I don't like any of these more than these. So I'm just going to ignore that. Even though I have this uh, thing that cost me 500 gold. It's just, uh, so you got to be flexible. So it was a good choice at the time. But not such a good choice now. Right. So let's uh, carry on to the right. Oh, I missed a little bit here. Let's go on to the right for now. I'll, I'll backtrack if I uh, have to. Oh god, here we go. Once the battle begins, enemies will do increased damage each wave. However, they drop more gold. I'll leave that for now. I'm going to try and look for a better weapon. Uh, just to make that easier. Because I've only got a common weapon still. Where is it? Here it is. So I need at least a green, possibly. Something's got to drop something at some point. Alright, so I'm going to go to demo form, demo stance. Let them follow me a bit. That guy's running away. For some reason, I ain't doing damage to him. But he's not adjacent with me, that's why. Alright, moved in at the right time there. 
I will go invisible. Get the first attack on him. Do I have enough? I'll break him here. Double break as well. Attack. Unfortunately, I need to move. So I might do. Yeah, I'll use a blink. Might as well. Sit behind him again. This guy's adjacent to me, which is really annoying now. I don't really want to take damage from that. Oh, wait, I got loads of shield. I'm probably okay. Yeah, I'll break. Keep doing that. I can probably just kill him, actually. Because the demo form gives me so much shield. It's really insane. Okay, so I took a tiny bit of damage there. It was not too bad, though. Um, I might as well blink. Break that. This guy's coming at me again. Should I let him hit me? Yeah. Okay. So now it's demo form again. So he's following me, which is nice. He's taking a lot of damage. Unless he walks into me, I can actually. Oh, maybe not. I need to break, Blake. I need to break plus blink, Blake. <laughs> Do that. Break this one as well. Damage getting higher. He's done moving to me, and now I can break him as well. Oh no, I ran out of demo form, so I can't break him now. I've got a lot of armor though. I got 61, so I'm just going to try and break him anyway. Move away to reset the stacks and then break. Okay, eight one armor. One, two. Three. This is on four. So I will move away. Move back again. I'll take some damage because I got 81. 42. I can probably take another hit. 52. Yeah. Okay. 62. I'm back up again. So I'm actually going to blink over to here. Break this again. I'm going to cast Demon Form. Look what armor I'm getting. This is crazy. I can tank him again, face tank. Some damage in. Keeping on my debuff, which is on three. Now I'm four. I don't really want status effect. I'm not scared of taking any more damage because I've got 127 armor. So unfortunately, I took those two hits there, but it's not the end of the world because that's literally only reduced me to down by 14 uh, because of that um, extra thing I had. Okay, so summon a random relic. Here we go. When attacking with the weakness aspect of an enemy one tile away, one extra normal attack will be executed. Doesn't really happen that often. Usual cooldowns by two turns when you never use blink, and when hitting an enemy without critting, obtain a 5% crit chance buff. The buff is stackable and will be removed when... Oh, okay, I'll take that. So that, plus this other common thing I got, which is really strong. I think this should be actually higher than a uh, common. I think it should be like uncommon or something, or rare. Yeah, that's really good. So I can remember not to get it actually, because that's 20 percent that's 25% damage plus that second. So I'm gonna be doing a lot of crits. And with dual daggers, I attack twice, that's like double the chances of crits almost and almost double the damage. So I walk over this way just to double check if there's anything else. Some meat there, so I can heal up to four if I need to later. You feel to go for that though. So what I'll do is I'll pull to here just to check that room. Make sure I don't miss anything. So let's go down. Hello, friends. Go demo form. Try and let him walk towards me. There we go. Now I can break him. Probably break this as well because of the fire. Does so much damage. So it does three plus the. I forgot that thing dodges. So three plus the thing. Okay, the, the, the fire is broken because he kept dodging my weapons. Oh god, I didn't watch out for the status effect. Okay, I got drenched. Okay, that's not too bad. <laughs> so I'll take the dream key. Grab all the gold in here. Oh. That's not cool. What, what are they doing? I don't know who's casting what, where? Um, I don't, I don't know. I don't, I don't know if I care. I think it's a safer spot. I just don't have a clue who's casting what. 
I got still stunned. I'm going to demo form here to set everything on fire. So demo stance on Oh, it's not setting everything on fire yet. If I go there, it will then probably set me on fire as well. I've got 43 armor. So I'm actually okay. I'm going to blink in there. Oh, it's not setting the grease on fire. Okay. I'm pretty sure it's going to explode the barrels. I've got to be careful. Let's move away. Strange. Very strange. Okay. So that was pretty much what was down there. That was it. So let's pull back here. And let's head up. Challenge encountered. Move for less than 10 times in this room. Blink excluded. The less you move, the better the reward. Okay, so I'll sit here. Skip my turns. Oh, screw it. I, just, I got that debuff, so I can't really do this challenge anyway. And these guys aren't moving towards me, so... Screw it. Screw it. So this guy moved next to me. I'm able to move for some reason. Oh, it's because I broke the shield? Possibly? I don't know. So I'll just keep moving and screw up the challenge. Oh, here we go, here we go. Shield of Frost creates and absorbs and shield and frees all enemies who attack you. It lasts for four turns. Okay, so I'm just gonna watch out for when that runs out. That's a good thing to keep an eye on. Um, I could probably be super sneaky here. Blink there, get an attack in, break him, and move out of the way. So I will apply uh, Demonic Stance. Walk up, break that. This guy's gonna blink into me, but I've got 31 armor anyway, so I'm not react fast. Yeah, he's, he's just tickling. Okay, now he broke it. Took a bit of my HP away. Um, yeah, I can probably just kite him for a sec. Blink next to that, break that. He's dead. How long have I got this one for? Okay, so that should break him. Or kill him. Even better. Okay, I've taken a bit of damage, but I'm just playing a bit more recklessly than normal just to uh, speed things up a bit. And because it gets a bit boring, everyone's kiting around. Okay, it's Rashambo guy again. Rashambo Master. Okay, Rashambo Master. Let me get all these pots of gold. And then I will come challenge you again. To the death. I've looked for you all over this labyrinth. My eternal rival is now time for a rematch. You again? After that legendary battle between us last time, I finally gained my purpose in life. I've trained long and hard for our reunion. Please do not disappoint me. What's so special about this game? I don't quite understand. Simple though, the rules be, infinite changes can be observed within this game. Three straightforward gestures are all it takes to gain a peek inside the human heart and mind. Let us not waste time on meaningless words. The battle ensures ensues, I mean. Right, I'm gonna go for the scissors this time. Paper, I've lost. <laughs> Yet I feel this uncontainable excitement pounding within my heart. Do you feel a strengthening bond between us as well? Like a hack hatching chick? Ever so eagerly waiting for its first peak of the outside world, like a defrosting river, like a budding flower. I'll see you next time for our final match, my eternal rival. So he gives me E death plus five, lasting two floors again. Oh god. So he's got that shield on, so I can't attack him for a while. Well, I can't break him and everything. No, I can't just attack, I can't attack him. Okay. So what I'll do is I'll just walk out of this casually. Looking for an opportunity. I'll go demonic stance. He's lost his shield now. So I can actually do something about him. So what I'll do is I'll use this uh, teleport attack. Teleport to target instead of a normal attack to it. Just a bit close. Oh, he put Shield of Frost up. God damn it. Walk out of that. I'm just gonna blink into this guy and break him. Get him out of the way. Break there, break this one. 
Okay, I can waste a blink here, which I, I mean a teleport, which I might do. Well, it's nice striking there, kills him. I got a lot of armor now. That just ran out. <laughs> I had a lot of armor now. So let's blink in, break that. This guy's got no shield again. Let's see if I can get in there quickly. Break it. Okay, Broom can't get me, so I'm okay just to smack here. What are these guys doing? They're making me go everywhere. Kill him. Come on, Broom. I got like 60 armor. 80. Damn, what such armor. Okay. Everything's there, sweet. Didn't get too much gold there, but. The pistol, secret vampires. No. No. I don't really like the pistols that much in this game. I think the only ranged weapon I actually like is the shotgun. Other than that, just, nah, I don't really like them. Rifle's okay as well, I guess. It's just a bit clunky to use, having to reload all the time. Oh yeah, I forgot about this. I was looking for a better weapon, wasn't I, to do that? Uh, okay, let's try going this way. Come on, give me a better weapon. Don't make me face the boss with a crappy weapon, guys. Come on. Come on. So, let's... Uh, crap, let's not do that. Damn it. Let's go invisible. I'll probably get the first hit in here. He's gonna move up. That's okay. Come on, one of them's gonna cast at some point. Okay, I'm kinda stuck here. I need to blink now. So I will blink. I'll just don't want the chance anyway. Might as well. Gives me a nice shield. This guy walks in, he's gonna be broken as well. Gonna need to keep an eye on that debuff, it's on free. So I can move now. Oh, is everything. Is that, is that it? Yeah, everything's delivered. Damn it. Damn it. Can't waste a bit of mana there. But it should recharge on the next encounter anyway. So let's go to the right. What's this? Ancient Elixir. I don't know what that does. I'm going. I'll come back to that just in case there's something better. So I've only got one key left. What is this? Um, all incoming damage reduced by half, but you'll also be afflicted with a random status, a uh, random elemental status condition with every hit you receive. You are now immune to elemental status conditions. Have all incoming damage. Ah, I'm not taking twice as much damage. What's this? Oh, every time I get hit, pretty much, all the gold will be moved, you have less than 10 in your possession. Once your gold is depleted, you will lose one soul shot for everyone. So, uh, literally, income damage will be neutralized by gold in possession. Okay, that's not cool, because um, I'd rather actually take damage than lose my gold. Alright, so let's walk back and grab that elixir. There's nothing else on this uh, floor. Let's see what it does. The effect of elixir is raised by 50%. I mean, it already heals me to 4 anyway, so it's kind of like... Redundant at this point. Uh, where's that uh, challenge room? It's here, okay. Let's see how much we can do on this one. So begin challenge. Hope it resets my mana. Okay, cool. Right, so first things first, we demonic stance while we can. Then, and then, I'm just gonna blink straight in and go on the guess if, or the offensive. So. We need to save some mana back. Break that one as well. I could probably break that as well. If I move there. So I got 100% more damage now. I don't know what he's doing, probably summoning something. I don't know what he's doing. Break that again. Another challenger appears. Boom. Guys, keep going, come on. Come on, 164 armor, bring it at me. Bring it at me. Continue. Oh, it runs out really soon, damn it. Oh. Hmm. Let's just walk up to here. Okay. I don't 
I think it's worth using that one more. I feel kind of sorry for him. He's just standing like, oh, I'm here to attack you. Right, uh, demonic stance again, or should I wait it out a bit? Maybe I should wait it out. I'll blink up to this guy, break him. What are you doing, bat? Hmm. Okay. Okay. Need to manage my resources a bit better. So my build's very bursty. Okay, I blocked the pig off, which is nice. Lost my armor there, which kind of sucks. Surrounded me a bit here. Kind of need to blink away here. I'll go invisible. I'll go invis. Okay, now I'm stuck. Let's get my turn. Come on, stop running. Okay. So I'm going to hit on him. Hit me again, break him. Here comes the bat. Got 20 armor. Tough decision. I think the back can hit through that though. Okay, the bat didn't hit me for some reason. So I'll stand here, break him down, kill the bat. Okay, okay. He's back out. It's got a reduction on him, 75%. I'll keep avoiding for now. Trying to avoid using abilities but it's not going very well because of what I've uh, what weapon I've got. Oh, he's got no frost shield so I'm going to try and go in and kill this guy. So I broke him. I'm getting a lot of armor from attacking here. Can I take that hit? Yes I can. Well kind of it. It's still really hurt. Pig's got me as well. Okay, I need to blink and finish that. This is really difficult. Especially if I do stuff like that. So I've sacrificed a bit of HP to try and save my mana. Ow, I didn't realize it's coming out. Okay, let's get a hit in there. Wait for this guy to do something. Come on. There we go. I blink in there. Oh wait, I can't really do much here. I just realised. Crap. I was going to do it. I'll take the hit. My legs will heal me to four anyway. Might as well use it to uh, gain some more gold as a resource. Okay, so let's try again. Stand near the book. Right, then they're right next to me. Jesus. Okay. <laughs> uh, I'll try and walk away. He's made it really hard for me to do much. There's quite a lot of mobs here as well. We'll be careful not to die. Penguin's kind of blocking me off as well. It's not going well. I'm gonna blink here. I'm actually gonna use a demonic stance here. I start breaking. Let's break the thing as well. Keep on that debuff is on two. This guy's getting close. He's got the life still aura, so he's gonna start draining me, which really sucks. Okay, he's really close now. So I'm actually gonna walk up to him and try and put the smack down on him instead. He's blocking the pig, which is nice. So I can get the pig here as well. Keep on that debuff is on two. Here comes the bat. Who's next? I need to move now. Got a lot of armor. I can face tank this. Got another turn before I have to move. 
Now I need to move because otherwise I could get hit. I've got 56 armor. I might be able to survive this. But I'm not going to risk it. This guy hasn't put a shield on yet. He's dead. That guy's got a frost shield. This guy's got 75% reduction to damage. So I'm going to wait for that. Even though I've got the armor, but it's about to run out. This guy. It's really hard to get this guy actually with daggers because he does this weird like whirlwind thing. Makes it very difficult. I need to blink out of there. I'll come back to him in a sec. Oh right, that's when you can get him. Oh right, okay. So this guy's got a frost armor on. I need to move out there. So one, two, three. Waiting for him to cast again. There we go. So I use a blink. Broke him as well. He's not taking much damage, but I am gaining a lot of armor again. So I can take a 45 uh, from him. Got one shield left. No more blinks. So I need to walk away. I'll walk out twice. <laughs> he blew himself up. So I'll wait for this guy to swing. And then I should be able to move in and get one hit in. And another. Okay, okay. Should I? Yeah, I'm gonna do it. Grab all the gold. Okay, so I got no mana here. This guy heals up. There's quite a few of these bastards around. I'll use one elixir. I'm going to go Demonic Stance as well. They kind of got me stuck here, really. I'll take a hit. Oh, he's not doing it. Okay. Got to blink in and kill the shrub. He's way too dangerous to leave alive. I don't mind taking that hit, either. This guy's got no shield on. Oh, there's a thingy here. I didn't realise. I didn't even see that. I'll blink here. Smack him. I should be able to break that my next attack and break that and that because of the, the fire aura that's hitting everything. Let's try and kill that quickly before this guy recovers. He's away from me. I've got quite a lot of shield here. So I took a hit, but the shield blocked it. I'm stuck in here, so I need to blink out and get something else. Do I still have the monk aura? I don't think I do. What if I can. No, he's too far away. This one's not, though. I'm actually going to go invisible. Okay, so slowly, slowly back away. Got three more turns left of that. Skip that turn. Okay, here we go. Should we smack down the penguin or should we smack down him? Let's do the penguin. Oh, the penguin can attack me straight away. That's weird. Let's move there. Break that. Okay, so that's 75%. What the hell? Who the hell put 20p in you? Okay, so he's dead. Got a lot of shield. I'll wait for him to walk up to me. She was about to run out quite soon, so I'll do that. Take a hit. Hit's not too bad. So he's broken. This guy's coming at me. He's coming at me. These guys are really annoying for dual daggers. See, it just leaves me in really bad positions all the time. Damn. So I blink away. You try and spread them out a bit. Come on. Come on. Is that him? Co invisible again. Trying to like get them to walk into these traps. No, I don't want to do it anymore. I might do it now though. Or they'll walk all the way around. He won. Well, I see if I can get one of these down. Got a lot of shields. I'll take a hit. Take another hit. Damn, I'm almost dead. Oh, 
these guys. Blink there. Move in. One. Two. Okay, I think that's... Uh, <laughs> That's most of my HP, so I'm going to leave now. That's really tough. Those guys are... Yeah, that was ridiculous. Try to do that. I wasted like a whole elixir there. So, I'm going to... Do, 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 have a look. Don't think there's any chance I need to do here, so I'm going to teleport. To be fair, I might even just wasted a lot of gold there. I could do that. But I'm going to be really greedy and try and do this boss with like 69 HP. The mana will be reset anyway, and hopefully a demonic stance. The shield will keep me alive. As long as it's not Vlad, I should be okay. Dua, Dua, who's Dua? Oh, God. She's got like guaranteed hits, this one. Alright, so let's uh, get a bit closer. How much did that hit me for? Do I have 60? I think so. Okay, demonic stance. Get out of the way. Get back in. This is so dangerous, what I'm doing right now. Really dangerous. She might hit me again. Okay, I'm low. I'm going to put next to her and just drink an elixir. Okay. She's almost broken here. Yeah, she's broken. Okay, so she's taking increased damage from elements. My demo form's giving me shield. I've got three turns until I have to move, so let's get some damage in. Should I take that stasis effect just for more damage? It's so greedy. I wonder if I can, like... No, it won't count. Let's move away. This guy's annoying as well. I think how to deal with that. I could teleport onto it, but it's gonna set me on fire. <laughs> I'll go here, make him walk around again. Get some more damage in. I've got a lot of shield here, so I'm just gonna keep going. Not quite sure what she's doing with that. I'm tempted to move there, just to stun it. I will. So stun her, so she can't cast anymore. Stun him as well. I'll carry on. My shield's actually blocking her quite nicely. Killed that. Shield's still blocking her, 53. That bomb's about to go off. I've got loads of blinks, so I'm actually not that worried about that. I'll go here. Smack her again. She's casting on me. I imagine I might tank this. I'm going to go demonic stance. Okay, she's in the fire, I'm in the fire. I need to blink out now. Because she's in the fire, I'm going to try and break her in it now. Just so it stacks up on her even harder. You can see how much damage she's taking on her health bar. So, how many times have I got? Three, four. I need to move out this one, so I'm going to do it. So I'm going to blink aggressively. Oh, wait, it doesn't remove it. Crap, okay. That does, though. Okay, that's alright. It's all good. I got loads of blinks still, so it wasn't even a waste. Let's try and get as much damage as I can on her. Uh, I'll keep going because I've got 100 effect on shield. I'm pretty much face tanking her at this point. <laughs> oh, not these guys. Fail of my existence. I need to move because of the debuff. Nice, she's moved into me so I can carry on going. Still face tanking her because I don't do enough damage to warrant me moving. Uh, I'll blink because I've got loads. Keep going. Try and break her again. She's getting pretty low. Um. Yeah, I'll blink that as well. I'm going ham here. I'm going ham. Going ham. I can probably tank him and her at the same time with my armor. So he's done. I'm going to blink again. Really aggressive here. Just trying to get it down. Keep going. More. I can face tank him because I've 130 armor. I need a better weapon though. This is getting ridiculous how much damage I do. Um, face tank him again. I need to move now, so I'm actually going to walk away, because they're over here now, 
I'm actually gonna blink here. And hit it one more time. Demonic stance. I can probably tank one hit from him. I'm gonna do that. I'll break him. Uh, she's casting that downwards so I can move there. I'll keep going for her, ignore the minions because they're tanky. She's trying to smack me but it's not doing anything. It's tickling me. Um, I mean, I'll move. I'll move again. She de summoned them, so that's good. So, what I'll do is I'll blink, smack her, smack her again, and she'll be down. Whew. Okay, so that was actually kind of worth it then, because that uh, challenge I wasted all my elixirs on pretty much and have one, just one for the boss. But it gave me a nice kind of like out, um, income from that, gold wise. So, let's pick up some more gold. That's real rare. Okay, so, ooh, 5% crit or skill power. So, in this case, crit's better. So, that squares really well with the daggers once again, in case I stuck with these daggers for the rest of the run. And, yes, my crit is 30% plus this is 50%. So I, I crit 50% of the time now. And daggers hit, always hit twice. So, summon a random relic. Let's see if we can get anything else that goes with crit. Attack with the target's weakness. More damage increase for. Eh. Use an item that's 25%. Uh, Okay, a second. Okay, this one's actually might be okay. I don't really. I try to set elemental status effects, but if I do get one for some reason, I might as well own it. You know, make it a thing, make it part of my routine, so to speak. <laughs> part of my routine. Yeah. So she wasn't too bad. She was a lot easier than Vlad was, even though I still had that shitty uh, common weapon. And that's the end of part fifteen. Like, subscribe, and I'll catch you in part sixteen. Take care.